guys welcome back to another Windows tutorial so uh, today we're gonna go ahead and talk about the Windows hotkey and how to use it and also how to create it now there's a utility uh, a free one that's called win hotkey that allows you to go ahead and create and convert your, your own hotkey and this little utility is right here and I'm just gonna go ahead and open it and set it up and if you guys want to go ahead and follow me as I move along with this installation go ahead and download it in the show more tab and the download link will be there uh, so what you want to do is when you get it is you want to right click on it run as administrator and next what you want to do is press next and press the uh, accept the agreement press next again press next once more and if you want you can go ahead and create a desktop icon press next and install now once it's done it's going to ask you to go ahead and launch it so what you want to do is you want to press finish now, what this little dialog says is, what is hot window hotkey? It allows you to go ahead and assign a system-wide world of hotkeys to anything that you want. So go ahead and read that once you get there, and then press next afterwards. Now, uh, this right here is the most common hotkeys that you would use, Shift, Control, Windows key, and Alt. Windows key is always important because that's the main key that you'll be using. And then after that, you wanna press next. And this right here gives you, you know, a little summary of what it will be doing. And then you wanna press finish. And after that, after reading, you'll be entered into the little utility, which is right here. Now, there's several ones that we all know and uh, we'll go ahead and focus on some so if i were to go ahead and press the windows key plus calculator or c i'll get calculator and if i were to go ahead and go to the windows u All i'll get in this section i'll get the uh, ease of access center and a bunch more so also like windows pause which should be on your keyboard you get up to the windows system utility and a bunch more now the whole point of this application and utility is to go ahead and create your own so what you want to do is if you want to create your own is press new hotkey after that you want to go ahead and give a description of this hotkey and we'll go ahead and describe it as open pictures folder so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press the Windows key actually I'm gonna press the alt key and I'm gonna leave the Windows key alone a hotkey that does not use blah 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 um, that's okay we'll go ahead and press yes along with the key I'm gonna go ahead and put P for pictures and then I want to go ahead and launch an application. No, I want to go ahead and launch a folder. And then I want to go ahead and click Browse. And then under Libraries, I want to go ahead and click Pictures. Uh, after that, uh, I should be given the chance of getting my pictures and then pressing OK and then press OK. Now, let's go ahead and test it. I want to go ahead and press Alt and then I want to press P. And there you go my hotkey has been developed and it opens my folder that I had chosen now there's a bunch of other things that you can do with it you can launch an application you can open a document you can open a folder like I just uh, had showing and you can type some text uh, not quite sure exactly the extensiveness of the usefulness of that and uh, control the current window and uh, etc so there's a various things that you can do with this uh, I would always recommend you guys to go ahead and learn the basics before you go into your own because basics gets you through a lot of things and this would be recommended especially those that don't have a mouse at the time or their mouse is not working at the time. So if you want to go ahead and get to, I don't know, um, the start menu, just press the start screen or if you want to go ahead and restore all the windows, you want to go ahead and press windows key M or control M and a bunch of other stuff so if you guys want go ahead and use this program called win hotkey uh, it's a utility it's free and it's for yours to take alright uh, and until next time take care guys